Hello everyone, and today we're talking about Tiny Tina's Wonderlands, Sisa Dungeons and the Dragon Summit spin-off of Borderlands. And in uh, some voice it feels like a complete inverse of the original game, it's by uh, no means uh, groundbreaking in fact. The worst parts of it, uh, because it can be uh, stubbornly stuck in its voice, uh, yet uh, Gearbox experience with his own formula proves uh, they still enjoy worth mining from the established Borderlands template serving as an effective reminder that even after all this time, it's still relatively singular in the industry's how thing to keep in mind. This review is coming from a single player perspective as we did not engage in cooperations or crossplay. During the review we are playing Bunkers and in Tina Tina and the Bunker Master so uh, what I say yes, uh, one of the biggest draws of Wonderlands is its constant parody of uh, tabletop role-playing games and the people who play them, it's uh, safe to say uh, that those who have spent time crowded around a table rolling uh, dice with friends so will easily get the most out of the game. Uh, the jokes Wonderlands uh, guess for could only have an air of authenticity about them. Such is a clash between the Bonker Master inciting uh, that an NPC means no harm and the player is inviting their own story. In their heads, uh, refusing to hear otherwise, the overworld map is uh, light red with things like uh, Cheto soda cans and popcorn again, uh, selling the idea that at the end of the day it's just friends having fun and shrine peace. Uh, catches your sweet little eye, the environments themselves, a uh, wonderfully detailed, vibrant and creative town, uh, splintered by giant uh, band stalks, is just one of the several visually impressive locations the game is uh, relentlessly uh, playful and uh, a sentiment that extends beyond. Uh, the D&D centric honor in one quest and Adorably polite uh, Cyclops simply wants to go on peaceful, archaeological Exarius, uh, which is a far cry from the normal Cyclops separating procedure of uh, went on violence. Look, I, I don't want to put you out any more than I already have. Here you can just leave my my here to die. It's perfectly all right. Wonderland's gas out of its way to highlight. Uh, Non-traditional characters and relationships as well, which is uh, refreshing to see I'm up to my card, uh, feast and undead for all that. It does well the uh, downfall of uh, Wonderlands is that it can be way too overwhelming and aggressive with, with its own. Uh, humor it's not even that the jokes are necessarily bad, uh, Percy just that the name will let up when it's joke after joke after it's easy to become number and tune out wonderland seems intent on cramming homer into every single uh, crevice and would have worked better if it allowed more breathing for room as the problem is exacerbated by the voice of the player the character instantly repeating the same one-liners throughout the entire game, sometimes the game does not even leave room for itself. And it is uh, fairly easy to unfortunately interpret a line of dialogue as another line triggers. Over top of it, Wonderland sees an all sugar energy drink of a video game and it can be as exhausting as it is entertaining, of course. As the bread and the butter of Wonderland is its skill loot a repeat loop and it does not disappoint, even uh, if it's largely retried in very familiar grounds as uh, there is an almost staggering amount of choice. And freedom in regards to character progressions, it's pretty wild. Uh, how dramatically a single new gun can change the entire flow of your own playstyle, you constantly sweep every aspect of well. Everything including things like magazine size, uh, bullet trajectory, elemental damage, how a spell is actually unlashed. I got a special figurine uh, for this guy, one second rising before. He is one of the Dragon Lords, uh, most loyal undead soldiers. It's, it's a regular role for 
in it you while the load can be too much. At times a series of feels as so you are spending a third of the game just comparing stats, it also ensures that you are never stuck in one style for very long for us. It got to the point where things changed so much uh, that we would cast a spell thinking it was uh, what previously equipped. Uh, that's how often uh, things get mixed up, the variety is enjoyable. On its own, uh, but perhaps more importantly, the sheer number of variables does a great job of convincing you how individual your character feels and that you uh, charting your own path. Uh, forward, it's also immensely appreciate how many cosmetic options uh, there are to unlock only are fattering the amount of self-expressions. Are they all exactly as they are where you come from chapter progressions? Is excellently based in the beginning options are uh, major, meaning you really have to understand the weakness of your chapter and arsenal after unlocking multi-classing, which is a uh, true uh, zenith moment. Uh, the entire game gets turned on, it's had you play two classes at once with access to two, two entire passive skill trees and four active uh, class skills that you can switch between uh, whenever you would like figuring out. How to get um, two completely different classes is such a blessing. 